Happy Wednesday, guys. Three days left until you can register for that open. Again, this Friday registration is closed. So for that CFW open camp, um, this camp is all about trying to fast track those goals and gain control of those health and fitness goals that you have. So um, whether it be movement, whether it be nutrition, recovery, you really want to try and get control of that. And by this camp, you're getting help with a coach for five weeks to help you guys guide yourself along that way. And also, it's perfect timing for the Open to get you guys ready for the Open, which is where all the magic happens in March. So uh, make sure you guys sign up for that. If you want more details on it, please check out our blog. Um, we'll start off with the wad today. So today's wad is a task to battle workout. Um, I found this on CrossFit.com and I thought it was a pretty interesting kind of uh, structure. So that's why I wanted to kind of combine it together with what workouts we've been doing lately. So task to battle here, we're doing um, 300 reps and this is of all movements. So not just one movement. So um, we're doing jumping squats for 20 seconds and you're resting for 10 seconds and 20 seconds of V-sits. 10 second rest, jumping lunges, rest, and then push-ups. So you're gonna count all the reps that you do, and you're gonna try to work towards getting 300 reps. And you wanna go, um, you wanna score those reps on each movement and accumulate them as you go. And you're gonna have to go through this as um, many times as you need to get 300 reps done, okay? So with today, the first thing I want you to really focus on is that control over your movement. So. There's some plyometrics, some jumping here as well with the jumping squats, the lunges, and with those V-sits and push-ups. I also want you to think about that control over your core and your arms there. So general control of the movements today is that main focus. And by doing that, we're gonna create a lot of consistency with that movement, with your movement patterns. Um, with that, as we can create that consistency, guys, that's where we can really hit that endurance point and really work on your endurance of your movements here. So we can work on the endurance of your legs, your uh, core, um, and uh, your arms as you do this. And with the rest in between, I want you to think about your recovery. So as you're resting those, between those 10 seconds, or sorry, at the 10 second mark, think about your recovery, take that deep breath in, really try to relax your heart rate, cool it off. That's gonna help you allow to maximize your work capacity. That's gonna help you condition those muscle groups, so those uh, targeted muscle groups in each movement here. So your legs, your core, your arms as you do this. So really think about your recovery to maximize that work capacity, really condition those muscles for your body composition goals there. Um, with that also said, guys, I want you to try to aim to score or finish this workout in about eight to 12 minutes. Um, so you're gonna have to go through this a couple times, um, but, but by the eight minute, 12 minute mark, you should be trying to finish this one um, or to get all 300 reps done. Or you can also think about it as 10 to 15 reps per movement per interval there, okay? Um, so after the workout, guys, we have the cool down, three sets, five and five Bulgarian squats, five second pause at the bottom. Use this as a uh, more to kind of flush out the legs and get a little bit of a stretch through those hip flexors, especially doing after all the, uh, those jumping squats and jumping lunges. So use that more of a stretch, cool down, get that lactic acid kind of flushed out. Um, and that five second pause helping you guys more to get deeper into that stretch. So make sure you guys get after that one. And also don't forget there is a demo video on the workout so you can see one of our coaches do the workout here. Um, just to get yourself an idea of how the workout runs um, and what the structure is like. Um, hope you guys enjoy the workout and we'll see you guys tomorrow.